So intersectionality as a word was coined in the mid 80s by a legal scholar, Kimberly Crenshaw. And I would urge anyone who's actually interested to just go read her original paper. <laughs> it's like really succinct. And there are lots of misunderstandings about intersectionality. Um, the idea, though, is that people have multiple and, yes, intersecting aspects of their identity that essentially put them at risk for various forms of discrimination or harm. And that can change contextually, but um, it's very important to understand. So if you are a woman who is black, you don't have the choice to decide whether you're being discriminated against as a woman or as a black person. You're actually being discriminated against as a woman and a black person, as a black woman. And that discrimination has a different quality, tenor, and intensity than the discrimination that a black man might face. And so there are um, so many examples we could go into as to how people are affected by intersectionality. Um, but, but I think it's better probably to read, read her original source. It's not that long. It's very clear. Hey, everyone. Thanks so much for watching the episode. If you're interested in contributing to the conversation and supporting the show, there's two easy things you can do. One, click subscribe. And two, visit our Patreon page where you get exclusive access to the Exploring Minds community.